Some like it warmer. We keep it warm through the weekend and beyond. Good Wednesday night, East Tennessee. David Aldrich, Captain Accurate here from the Captain Accurate Weather Command Center. Well, you can see we hit 74 today in Knoxville as well as Oak Ridge. 75 in Athens. A very warm day indeed. Well, what were you calling for? I was calling for 71. We outperformed by 3 degrees by my estimation, and we were 1 degree above normal. Hardly any wind today. It peaked at 11 miles per hour earlier in the day. A lot of clouds moving in now. Expect a mostly cloudy sky. Some spots of rain will form in the overnight. Maybe a rumble of thunder shortly after sunrise tomorrow. But some of the energy in blue and some of those colder cloud tops in yellow and orange trying to work its way here, but it's moving into somewhat drier air. More warmth on Thursday, expecting a high around 77. Upper 70s will be more common with some spots of rain. Maybe a rumble of thunder. 80s this Friday and into the weekend, even on Monday. Oh yes, and even from the lens of the Storm Prediction Center, they have us under the lightest shade shade of green, which thunder is possible, but the stronger storms on Thursday will be in yellow between Kansas City, Topeka and Wichita. But back here, we'll keep a watch fly, maybe a rumble of thunder in Kentucky from Bowling Green to Middlesbrough, even into Knoxville. So again, lightest shade of green, nothing severe here, but a thunderstorm cannot be ruled out. Temperature outlook, you know that dogwood winter is going to come back in late April because April 30th, it suggests cooler than average. So yes, everything ebbs and flows, just like you can't go to the beach and expect high tide the whole week you're at the beach. Oh, that's what I want because I like to boogie board. Well, maybe so, but sometimes it's low tide. Sometimes it ebbs, sometimes it flows, and it's going to be getting cooler likely by the end of the month once again, where we could be in the upper 30s to low 40s once again. Precipitation outlook through the end of uh, April suggesting slightly below average during that time frame. Now, when it gets warm, I've talked about this. There may be many things on your table or menu. Uh, maybe you want to do the car wash. Maybe you don't want to do the work yourself. You'll take it through one of those cool machines that does it for you. Maybe you just want to sit down and blow some bubbles with the kids. That's cool, too. When it's in the 80s, maybe you're called out to the bicycle. Maybe you want to hang out with some friends and family. Maybe have a picnic on the picnic table outside. That's also very cool. But maybe, maybe the dogs want to get social at the dog park. Maybe that's what's calling your name because that's what they like to do when it gets warm, I imagine. And, of course, the fishing rod. You might want to catch some catfish, some bass, maybe some trout, or maybe even some perch. I don't know what you like to catch, but the fishing rod, also a good idea and maybe something on the grill. Hot dogs, hamburgers, ooh, that's also pretty inviting, especially if the grill's, what, 425, 450 degrees, you're ready to fire up the grill. That's also cool, but I like the idea of maybe camping. Take your Tennessee orange tent and go camping in the Smokies. Maybe you've been waiting to do that, and this may be the perfect weekend to do so because you know it's naturally cooler in the mountains. Smokies may be calling your name. couple of showers now moving through Memphis this evening through western sections of Kentucky. Our future cast shows the progression of the cloud cover and the rain. Not a whole lot of clouds maybe in the short term, but 1 o'clock. In the morning, it may be raining around Monticello, north of Jamestown. Let me take you from 1 to about 3 a.m., still raining north of Jamestown. Then it brings it into Wartburg, Crossville, Oneida, Jamestown, by 4 5 a.m. Eastern Time. Then it slides from the plateau into the valley at 7 o'clock. Sun's up about 4 minutes before 7 a.m., so now we got a passing shower. Okay, verification right there. But then there's possibly a rumble of thunder with the next line that comes in like so, boom, boom, comes out like that before noon. So I'd say between 10 and noon, you might get a little impulse, maybe a spot shower with rumble of thunder between Kingston and Warburg. And then it's gone. Temperatures will finish in the upper 70s tomorrow. And then we really start the warming process on Friday when I'm expecting lows in the 50s and afternoon highs reaching into the lower 80s. Ooh, lower 80s, that sounds very nice. Now I see why you wanted to suggest camping in the Smokies. Tonight we're down to 52. Mostly cloudy and mild spots of rain. Late winds about 3 to 8 miles per hour. Tonight down to 51. Wartburg and Oneida. 49 Morristown. Not nearly as cold as it was this morning. A pair of sevens Thursday. Partly sunny. Spots of rain. Maybe a rumble of thunder in the morning. Even late morning. And then Thursday 79 for Newport. 78 for Maryville, Alcoa, Teleco Plains, and Athens, and only 72 for Crossville in the heart of Cumberland County. Here's your Captain Accurate Weather Authority forecast for Knoxville and East Tennessee. 82 on Friday. It does turn warmer. 85 on Saturday. Well short of the record high from 1965. But I just put it up there for context. Sunday, 
84, 85 on Monday, and I think the best chance will come in Monday night into Tuesday pre-dawn hours where we get some rumbles of thunder, maybe a downpour, but depending on timing, could be strong to severe. But look at the outcome. We're down to 42 Wednesday morning with highs around 65 Wednesday afternoon. You can keep track of it all using the Captain Accurate Weather app. It's free, powered by my friend Pete Michaels Traffic. Keep you and your family safe. Just search Captain Accurate at the App Store and Google Play. Well, my name is David Aldridge. Some people call me Captain Accurate. It's not easy being accurate, so weather doesn't surprise you. We'll see you here next time. Take care.